Hello gamers far and wise, welcome to the Forge of Bad Gaming Decisions. Like my fresh cut, cut all my hair off, had to trim it I had to do it myself. Um, but my goal is to get 100 subscribers, and I know I lose you guys about 30 seconds in, so I wanted to let you guys know to comment, like, subscribe, stay wise, and let's try to grow my channel. I really, I really like what I do, it's really fun. I just want to get more people to start watching my stuff. So as always, stay tuned, we're going to go over what this video is about soon. All right, gamers, so today's video is, wow, I have 2,598 hours in Smite. Woof. <laughs> Sorry, I got distracted. We're going to be going over PlayStation Plus April games of the month. So, as always, let's get right into it, shall we? So, I know the three games are Reach Maker, Tales of Iron, and Adventures of Sackboy. So, I'm going to show you guys the view like how many gigs how big all that stuff and then we'll go from there all right so let's get into that i'm gonna pull up each video and we'll go get right into it all right so first we have meet your maker right it actually releases on the fourth that's one of those things that playstation and sony are doing where they're releasing games for playstation plus on the day that it releases so like stray to chia and Meet your maker, but meet your maker is the first for PlayStation Plus essential gamers. The other two have been PlayStation Plus extra and premium. So here we are with this one, right? No, it hasn't been out yet, so I can't tell you how many gigs it is, but we can go over the video. But essentially, from my understanding, it's a dungeon crawling game. So you make a dungeon and then other people have to invade your said dungeon. So you have to build a dungeon, build a tier, and people have to come and invade your dungeon and try to raid it um it's a first person shooter type game it looks it looks pretty fun we're gonna start the trailer for it real quick that comes with it but um it looks like a good game and i was hyped for it before but now i'm even more hyped for it so it's created by the guys that made dead by daylight which is one of my favorite games but um just fast forward to the part where yeah see so you get to make your own dungeon and then you get to team up with people and destroy the dungeon so it's two players online and then it has vibration functions for ps5 control or remote control um so it looks good looks like they have some other intro videos here but that's the game for this one it looks like it's going to be a good game now so i'm looking forward to playing this and showing you guys the video of this because this looks like an in-depth one that's going to end up staying on my channel hold on I need coffee Yep, always need coffee in the morning. You know how these things go. All right, so the next one we're going to get into is Tales of Iron. Alrighty, so the other game, Meet Your Maker, didn't actually have a price because it's not going to be sold. It's going to be essentially a free-to-play game, I guess. So, well, that's, you know, that's a good question how they're doing that. But Tales of Iron is about 25 bucks. It's about a gig. It's two years old now. It's going to be two years old now. Um, apparently it's an RPG adventure with brutal combat and you play as a rat. So from the videos that I can tell, it looks like a roguelike RPG game, but 2D scroller and doesn't look like there's anything in it, but it does look rather interesting. The art style is pretty good. Um, I'm looking forward to playing this one too, just because, I mean, look at some of these murderings. That's pretty dope stuff. So this game is i believe single player yep and it's an action adventure game so these are kind of the other games that um are like that a game i guess but i don't see anything in here that i played on my channel that's similar to it so it's gonna be a first so i'm looking forward to playing this one it's one of those games where it's like looks not interesting but then you play it and you probably feel like a dope like a dope gamer when you go kill things you know so this month is already starting to look uh, compared to march march looked solid right march looks solid this march this month not feeling it not feeling it so far we only have two we're gonna get into the last game which is Sackboy boy adventure so sack boy adventure is a 60 dollar game right it's three years old now at this point i think this was one of the first six, 66 gigs 
I think it's one of the first games that came out for the PlayStation 5 and PlayStation 4, like right when the PlayStation 5 came out. But it's your typical Sackboy game, you know? It's an adventure Sackboy game. I'm pretty sure you get to customize them and do all that good stuff. Um, the Deluxe Edition comes with a bunch of things I don't really think it's necessary. Um, supports up to four players with PS Plus Online. I also believe it has normal couch co-op, which I'd have to look into it. But it's something that... Ooh, a freebie. Sackboy. All these costumes are free now. Bet. So, I feel like this is um, a game that I'm going to be able to play with my daughter. And really, you know, have another father-daughter gaming vlog moment where we kind of play this game and run around and play around. I think that's another good game. And something that falls in her ability to, you know, do these things. Um, as of right now... They haven't released. They haven't released. Um, as of right now, they haven't released the PS Plus Premium and PS Plus extra games of the month. That's going to be released later on in the month. Usually, to last month, they released it at the same time as the essential games. This month, they just released the essential games, and they didn't release the games that are going to be later on in the month. So. We're going to have to wait for that update video. Usually those, that news gets dropped the second week of the month. Usually a week before the third Wednesday of the month. Sony's pretty much on a nice little schedule here with that. So expect a video of the extra and essential games. So then uh, for right now, those are all the games that are being released for PlayStation Plus. They have a Kratos skin. They last know I'm just gonna get I'm just gonna play this just to play as Kratos as an adventure sack boy. Yep, you got me sold, sack boy. You got me sold. Um and then Don't forget, as always, to check out I'll be dropping a Smite video today for Smite Season of Hope. We're gonna go over um their stuff. I don't even know, it probably isn't anything, to be completely honest with you, because it never is. It's a bundle, but they don't ever give you anything good in the bundles. That's a free PlayStation Plus exclusive. And then you're like, what is it? What do I get? You get nothing. You get a jump skin. Here. So we got Aphrodite, three Maya gods, their voice packs, and a 30 day account booster. And then this unlocks all these voice packs, which I probably already have all those ready because I've obviously played 2,598 hours of Smite. But I'm going to be making a Smite Season of Hope 2 video, probably. Um, I still have to do my Untitled Goose game. Um, we still have Outriders and Destiny. And then the Minecraft Dungeon series with my daughter. Where we're going to try to beat the game. But And then I have Dead Cells, the Vampire. Uh, wow, why can't I speak right now? <sighs> the Count. There we go. The <laughs> Return of Castlevania is what I need to beat. For that game so those are kind of what's looking what's looking for the, over the horizon over this next couple over this month i uh, still gotta beat jack too so i'm gonna work on all those um and then we'll go from there so as always wise gamers don't forget to comment like subscribe Ooh, and i'll be the show how much that game cost i do like the show 70 bucks at 110 gigs mm -hmm. Nope, 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 nope. I'm a no for me. It's a no for me. Maybe. <clears throat> Maybe I might. I might. We'll see. We'll see. I really like baseball games. But we'll see. We'll see. I might make a series of that where I start a baseball play or legend and then pitch my way to the World Series. <laughs> As always, don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and check out my other videos. that will be in the link description below. And if you like content like this and you want me to go over more games and more like how big their files are and stuff like that and you know just leave a comment below and i will try my best to get to them so as always thanks for stopping by wise gamers and this is a pretty quick update video so thanks for stopping by everyone and i will catch you in the fortress of bad game decisions